I started fingerboarding back in 2001, and back then it was uh, a lot harder to stand out, um, mostly because all of the fingerboarders were uh, similar styles. I mean, there, there was pretty much two different styles to characterize yourself, and uh, there was gnar and there was tech. And um, either you, you sided with one of those, or you tried to stand out the best you could, and um, and everyone just wished you luck at whatever you tried to do. Um, but I guess I considered myself one of the few that uh, kind of stuck in between. Um, I was on a few teams with uh, most of the NAR guys, like uh, Raymond Rivera and Dan Meckler, and uh, I was also on teams with tech guys um, like like Deshaun. And uh, looking back, like seeing how the scene is today, after I took my three and a half, four year break, um, coming back to the scene is just kind of uh, a weird experience because now the every every fingerboarder is is tech so when i came back I, I realized that this is my chance to to really stand out and and not because i've had eight years of experience or or because i i i'm an og um but mostly because like it's it's something i can do for fun it's fingerboarding like it's supposed to be fun it's not supposed to be serious business so after watching tons of Patrick Melcher and Chris Islam videos, um, I, I figured that, like th this is the way I can stand out is is mimicking these tricks and um, adding on to to what they're doing and um, it making it so much more fun for uh, for me and for I'm hoping it make it makes it more fun for other people to watch me. Um, but but coming back, uh, one of the first things that I heard from Deshaun after hearing, after not talking to him for for three and a half years, is, hey, I've got this this whole new thing set up, this this thing called Bubble. Um, I I really want you to be a part of it, and um, I mean I've been on teams with with Deshaun before, and I, I I couldn't see myself in a different place. Like I I felt I feel comfortable, um, being under his roof, and um, and being part of uh his family and so I, I'd really like to um, thank uh, Deshaun for uh, extending his hand out to me and um, and not just letting me be a part of this team but uh, but but being part of this family um, as he calls it and as I like to think of it um, and and it's great to be on a team with such diverse writers and um, with such a great solid product so with that said I, I just hope that uh, you look at this uh, this company as more than just a company uh, but as a as a revolution and as, as corny as that sounds uh, I, I really hope that uh, you take in consideration what what we're capable of and um, and what what's to come from this uh, this outstanding group of people